that was booming. Hey YouTube, what's up? It's me, Gears of the End, and welcome to Dark Souls, Scholar of the First Sin 2 Blind, Part 1. Let's play. I think I got that all out there. Is this the best Dark Souls, or best Souls game yet? I intend to find out. If you have seen my other playthroughs, I've gone through Dark Souls 1 and Bloodborne. And uh, now with the hype of Elden Ring, we're going to go into Dark Souls 2, Scholars of the First Sin. The most beloved of the Souls series. So I've heard. No, I know. I know people don't like this game. Well, I don't know if people don't like it. They definitely just think this is not one of the good Souls games from what I've heard. But my trick is to find out. That's why this series is going to be titled The Best Souls Yet. <laughs> and just to get the clickbait haters. If I got you, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Let's go. Oh my god, that was loud. Let's sign in. Begin playing with me. Okay. Saving content. Can I just accept? I don't have to scroll, do I? I have to scroll through all of this? Scroll, 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 this is, this is ridiculous. And accept. Saving content. Don't turn it off. Retrieving information. No new information. Okay. Switch profile. Okay. Let's just go new game. Oh my god. Blood on. Subtitles on. I guess we'll just leave it. Adjust brightness until flame is visible and dragon invisible. There's a dragon? Oh my god. Uh, I guess... Let's, I don't, let's go with this one, I guess. Uh, I'll mess with all this stuff when I'm actually in the game, I guess. Saving my content. As you can see, I've never even touched this game. I bought it when it came out on Xbox One. Perhaps you've seen it. Maybe in a dream. Maybe. A murky, forgotten land. Okay. Ooh. Rain. Has it ever been in a Dark Souls game where there's been rain, actually? I don't think we've had that, have we? Someone died. A place where souls may mend your ailing mind. What? You will lose everything. What the? Once branded. Okay, they're talking about the brand. The symbol of the curse. Okie dokie. Is that guts? An augur of darkness. Yeah. Your past, your future, your very light. Everything's melting away. None will have meaning, and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. Ooh, a spider. A thing that feeds on souls. A hollow. Ooh. Old woman? Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north. Lordran? A great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Okay, but it's not Lordran. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? But one day, you will stand before its decrepit gate without really knowing why. Okay. This is the weirdest intro. Obviously, I can only compare it to Bloodborne and Dark Souls 1. Like, Bloodborne, it, like, gets right into there. Like, you're just on a table. Boom, go fight a werewolf. This, Dark Souls 1, it's like, okay, here's this, here's the souls, here's the kingdom. Here's all the big bads. Or the big, I don't know. And then, boom, this is the more cryptic as shit. Bunch of lightning bugs and skeletons, my favorite combination. 
I also like that the character had the um, the mark, the Dark Soul on his upper back shirt. Just put it on his neck already. I feel the music is telling me this is epic. I don't know why. Okay, that's pretty epic. Hate those enemies. Like a moth drawn to a flame, your wings will burn in anguish. It's like okay, that's straight time up. after time. Okay, that's straight from Dark slash Hercules. An eyeball. A lot of eyeballs in this. Huh? For that is your fate. My fate. The fate of the cursed. To jump in a vortex? Whee! What is going on? <laughs> I'm cursed. I have the dark soul. Or whatever the mark. The brand. My brand. And then I have no idea what to do. <laughs> Rapier! Just, okay, that loads fast. Okay, we can actually get into the game. How long is it? Ten minutes! Okay! Okay, I jumped into a... I jumped into a vortex and now I'm on a plateau? A shrine? Is there a shrine maiden? Because that's what I need right now. When is he finally going to add a companion? In one of these games? You know, it's just a little buddy. Whoa. Oh my god, people are still playing this game. I have nothing. Let's see. My RB is my little punch. LB is a little punch. Left triggers. That. Just trying to get my feel for the game again. Okay. A does nothing, right? Oh, that's accepting stuff. Oh, this is cool. Just look at the camera and do some do back steps. Let's see. Okay. It's not inverted. That goes down this way. Do I have like auto centering on or something? No. It it just I don't know. Maybe I'm just not used to it. It just feels a little weird. Uh, run. Yep. So it's the only thing to do is just to go forward, I guess. Stay out of the tall grounds. Oh, that's a little sensitive. I might need to turn that down. I'll probably go through all those settings some of the time. Really, it just starts me off with nothing, huh? Am I at half health? I can't even tell. Oh, God. I can't even tell if I'm at half health or something. Okay, that's a big skeleton, actually. What's that noise? Oh god! The hell are you things? Little gremlins? Hey, little ghosty man. They're feasting on the bone. They do look like little gremlins. Look at their faces. Ooh, what's this way? <gasps> My first item. Is it a weapon? A rusted coin. Let's see. Equipment. Uh, rusted coin. Temporary boosts luck. What? Rusted coin. An old ruined rusted coin. Crushing the coin temporarily boosts luck. This rusted coin gives you that little extra bit of luck, making items and the like easier to find. This coin is engraved with the image of a god that was worshipped in ancient times, but no one knows. The true origins. What the fuck does this mean? <laughs> what else items do I have? I have the black separation crystal. Bone of order. I have a bone to pick with you. Okay, I don't know any kind of like RNG in these games. I guess. Player status. Message. Read history. Written history. Game options. Screen options. Quit. Let's go over that. Um... Anything over here? No, this is all walled off. Urka Durka. Okay. 
Did I miss anything? I don't think so. Should, should I try at attacking one of these guys real quick? Yeah. Yeah. Nope. Not gonna happen. Oh, I punched him. Oh, I stun locked him. That's right. Oh, God. Oh, God. I killed one? Ha <laughs> ha! I made a mistake. Oh, I made a big mistake. Let's just run away now, shall we? You guys can't cross that, right? Okay, good. <laughs> Almost died immediately. But at least I found an item before, before it died, right? Is this something? Okay, this is something. Well, okay then. Looks like Littlefoot's up here. Dun, 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 dun. I heard a snarl. Okay, let's just go this way. I I wish I didn't fight the stupid gremlins because then I like, I would run up there and see if there's an item or something, but like I can't a, a blink will kill me. How do I get over there? I guess I can try jumping, but they perfectly put the tree in the way. Never mind. I found it. Small, smooth, and silky stone. I think I know about that, but I don't think I ever really... I, think it's silky. I don't know if I ever did that in Dark Souls or not. Are these bones hanging from ropes? Or are they supposed to be chickens? these chickens? What the fuck? I think they're chickens. Oh well. Okay, I guess we're going in the hut. Open door. Okay, here's the storyteller. Wait. Did my character... <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh my. Your face. The face of the curse. Okay. It's an undead. So we're undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I think I'm. You're finished. You go hollow. Yes, you will become one of them. Hollows prey upon men, feast upon their souls. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> <laughs> what is your name? Uh... Okay. What is my name, everybody? My name is Mario. No, let's go with... Wait, I haven't just realized. Did I even do a character creation? Do I even have, like, a male or female? Am I just... Oh, I guess I'm... Maybe it's right after this. Um... Uh... What should my name be, everybody? Oh, I hate deciding these on the on the quick thing. Um, Sally. No. Uh, Scoob. Let's go, Scoob. Scoob, it is. Okay. 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 Scoob, are you sure? Yes. <laughs> At least. You know your own name. That was a weird laugh. Here's your reward for sharing. It's a human effigy. Oh, okay. Take a closer look. Who do you think it's supposed to be? Think back. Deep into your past. 
Yes, it's an effigy of you. This is a weird... Okay, there's the character creation. This is definitely a weird start <laughs> compared to Dark Souls 1 and uh, Bloodborne. Uh, gender. <laughs> um. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I love how it's just the head gets skinnier and the thighs get legs get skinnier. These are funny. Uh, oh my god. Did not skip leg day. Because this is like the most average. I guess let's just go basic. Is that supposed to be ripped or like fucking dying? I cannot tell. Wait, let's go that, and then... I can't, I can't tell if this is like emanciated, emanciated. I don't like it, so let's just go that, let's go that. Uh, class and gift, class. Warrior, knight, swordman, bandit. This is a freaking, what the, this is... This character's out of freaking Borderlands! What the hell? Cleric. A Sosoi. Explorer. It even has a monocle. Are you fucking kidding me? And deprived. Unclothed origin unknown. Has nothing to fight with except life affirming flesh. Well traveled explorer. Not terribly powerful, but as many items. Knowledgeable sorcerer. Cast sorceries with high intelligence and attunement. Uh, pilgrimage. Alright, as tradition on all my playthroughs of these games, I'm I go deprived. The worst start I can get. Gift. Nothing. Life ring. This ring of old slightly increases HP. A familiar looking effigy returns the hollowed to life. Okay, so that's a new item. What does that do? Various items used to cure poison and restore HP essential for anyone traveling. Homeward Bone. Seed of the Tree of Giants. A seed grown from a tree of giants. Inedible. I feel like... Okay. Toss into a bonfire to raise the strength of nearby foes. Only for those who seek greater challenges. So this is like a hard mode? Does it only work around one bonfire or can you keep doing it at every bonfire and then also i wonder if it only works once that could be interesting a simple petrified lump it may be of some use someday okay so this could be nothing it could be something i'm thinking between that and the seed uh Seed of a Tree of Giants. I feel like you plant this and then you come back to it later. Luigi's Mansion style. You gotta water it a couple times. Mm. This is just teasing me, saying it's something. Eh, I'm gonna go with the seed. Uh, did I go anime hair, fryer hair, twin pigtails? Ponytail, braided. I mean, bald. Ah, let's go anime. Hair color. Oh yeah. Eyebrow, eye color. I keep hitting buttons. I'm not even doing anything. Go green. Alright, that's good for me, everybody. Let's advance settings. Oh god, I'm not getting into that. I am not good with that stuff. How do I how do I finish? Finish. This is my true self. Twenty minutes in, I've fought All a gremlin. People come here for the same reason. To break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm doesn't stand a chance. 
Well, you never know. <laughs> okay, I obviously know what these women are like based off of like uh miss fantasy wise to hop and trot along to the kingdom. But remember, hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Okay, thanks. Oh, for I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. <laughs> Is that the game director just straight up saying you're gonna die over and over again? That, that, that's exactly what that is, isn't it? Okay, so far this game is obviously it's like reminds me of a combination of like the Hercules movie, that myth, and uh... Oh, I got an achievement. Self-recollection. Reclaim flesh and set out- oh, no, now my health is full. Okay, so my health was halved? Oh, yes. Some pot-breaking brownies, baby. Um... So these are obviously the three blind women, basically. Uh... <laughs> laugh at my ass? Okay, that's rude. This is a limbo. A link between Drangleic and the outer world. Fair traveler, I know that you must have a story. Why else would you visit such a place? This lost, decayed kingdom. Okay. So we were okay. I thought for a second it was kind of weird, but we talked to one of these people, one of these females, sorceresses, in a different plane, the real world, I'm guessing, and then we jumped down the vortex of hollows, and then now we're in like the limbo area where they are. And it's because they even said, oh, you talked to that old woman, huh? She told you to come here. Oh, mm. oh my first chest. Pick up item. Another human effigy. Oh, I should probably read what those do. It said something about, like, gain back some humanity. Uh, okay. Reverse hollowing. Human effigy, a warm, soft, shadow-like effigy. Use this item to reverse hollowing. It also weakens the links to other worlds, preventing invasions and most cooperations. Peer closely at an effigy, and one begins to perceive a human form. But whose form? Dun dun dun. Huh. Black separation crystal. Seed of the tree of giant, a lump of something obtainable from a giant tree makes enemies react to invaders when the giants fell they grew into great trees interesting death is not the end for anything that has ever once lived remains as part of a great cycle of regeneration but what of those outside of the cycle okay so i took an item okay this is a consumable damn it i should have went with the should i get the other thing um so, if I get invaded, I, like, use this, and then all the AI just attack the uh, invader, I'm guessing. That's what it sounds like. Uh, Smooth and silky stone. I can restore some HP with it. The shine of this stone is no ordinary polish and can only be achieved over a long period of some... Wait, over a long period. Uh, some in this land are in search of such stones. Erka Derka? So can I not go and fight the big guy because I don't have a weapon yet? Wait, didn't they give me an effigy? <laughs> Almost like a doflamingo laugh. You must go on a journey without rest. Well, I suppose if you find yourself at an arm pass. But if your will is yet unbroken, then you may return here to start again with a clean slate. 
What? It's like start a new game? What? <laughs> Interesting. Uh, can I go through this door? Okay, I can open that door. Where does this go through? Is this why I came in? Okay, this is the way I came. There's a little bridge thing there. Okay, let me go, since I have full health now. Wait, let me... Inventory. Backshot. Uh, sort. Default position held. Oh my god, I don't remember how to... Discard, leave, discard, leave. What the fuck? How do I add items to my inventory and stuff? Ah! I don't remember. Oh well. I don't have a weapon yet. I'm just gonna run up here real quick like. God, you go through stamina fast. Let's see if there's any items. Do do do. I think I saw an item. Okay, then I could have just done this. Done that. Oh, he's still trying to get me, huh? He's a fatty though. Oh god, you move slow in the water. Let's, let's avoid that. Oh, uh, then he goes, ooh, gnarly. Okay, he was protecting something. Gold pine resin. That sounds familiar. Oh god. <laughs> Your uppercut missed. Oh, he's got one eye. Okay. When I get something to stab or bash you with, I'll come back. Does that work for you, guy? It certainly works for me. Let's get moving. Okay, so like all first episodes, it's, you know, mostly story heaven. Heaven. Heavy. Me trying to figure out how to move. Ew, a bonfire. What is this? Bonfires are places of respite. You may also light torches on them. Okay, this. Why is the tutorial thing different? Why isn't it just like a sign on the ground like the old game? It's an actual like stone. What the? How come I can't get this? Ah. Uh. Uh, I can't. Okay. Some I apparently items have health. Soul of a lost undead and a torch. Okay, that should be a weapon. You know. What? What the hell? Slot weapon right weapon. I don't have a. What the hell? The torch doesn't count as a weapon no more? Aww. Uh -oh. Okay, here we go. Belt slots. Do I even want to put one of these on the belt slot? I don't think so. What, can I not light this? I'm in my inventory. Shut up. Everyone shut up! Ooh, sparkly. Rest that bonfire. Travel, attune, burn. What is burn? A warm, soft shadow like effigy. I can burn effigies? I don't know why. Okay, so they straight gave you an item box and I can travel. That's new. Um. <gasps> God race. What the fudge? Is there a boss alright already? I don't have any. I don't have a weapon yet. I just lit the torch and I have five minutes. Can I, can I? Wait, what? Is it, is it gone forever now? Wait, what? I'm so confused. I have any video game logic tell that I taught me anything. It's that always light all the freaking torches. Oh look, there's another one of those guys over there. Light my Oh, that's right. Okay, there's just a stone dude there. I remember like the, the torch was a big thing for the trailers for this game. If I remember correctly. Do, do, 
do do Light my way. Pull back. Tears. Be wary. Oh. My. God. <laughs> well. This bit gets the end. Thanks for watching everybody. Glad to be back. Oh. Scared me. Tune in next time where we die. Peace. Muddle of an out.